listen, I will never look down on anyone who is on that journey of becoming a profitable trader. I remember my journey as a beginner and how confusing life was in terms of Forex. And number th one of the things that really confused me, I can remember was not even understanding uh, I need a broker. I remember when I used to tell people, why can't I trade by myself? Do I really need a broker? Like that's how, I would say ignorant, like that's how green I was. And if you're watching this video and number one, you have never heard anything about Forex or number two, you want to start Forex, but you don't have a broker because uh, maybe you have tried other brokers or even you don't know you need one. This is the video for you. In this video, I want to share why I have used XM broker for the past four years, guys, four years. Like even saying that is mind blowing, knowing the journey and how even I ended up to uh, use XM and what happened. And I will give you that story. And then at the end of the video, uh, I will show you how we shall create a live account. And from this video, everyone watching me will have a live account. So if you have ever wished to open a live account and you don't know how, watch this video to the end and trust me, be by the end of the video, you will have a live account. I will show you how to fund and I will give you reason why always you should choose XM because I'm using XM broker for the past four years. Okay, so back in 2020, I was using another broker and that broker, uh, we used to fund the money using Bitcoin. So there was nothing like M-Pesa, you guys. So we, I would, I would, uh, I would have to understand what is Bitcoin. Remember, 2020, Bitcoin in Kenya was not that familiar. So forex is not familiar. Bitcoin is not familiar. So I have this platform. I'm being told for you to place a trade in your MT4, you need a XM broker. Uh, you need a broker, and that one was so confusing because I was asking these people were telling me why can't I just enter the market by myself but uh, they didn't even give me a good answer they just told me you need a broker you need a broker so for me they they requested I go with this certain broker uh, in my first year of trading my first month like when I just uh, you know the mt4 give you the demo so after after practicing on the demo i really wanted to now go live and fund my account so i happened to open with this broker and when i went for the depositing they were asking me to deposit with bitcoin now i had to go back learn about bitcoin it was so hard and this broker mind you they had a limit uh, a limit amount uh, uh, the 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 mark the minimum you would have deposited was a hundred dollars and that was around twelve thousand back then twelve eleven thousand so you can understand there's limitation for depositing the method of using is bitcoin like that's how hard for me like that was my introduction so i funded a hundred dollars i had to go buy bitcoins it was another hassle so i stayed for months without depositing my initial account because one i didn't know how to deposit and i had to now look for bitcoins i didn't know or what even i was doing i thought even my money will get lost so in this account of a hundred dollars any amount that i would have withdraw again they will not give me any payment method that is familiar to us in kenya it was still through bitcoin so i struggled to trade with that broker for one month and in in the end of the month i made money and then i lost the account so when I lost the account, of course, as a beginner, and I'm talking about 2020, I lost that account. As a beginner, I could not, um, I could not, uh, I could not fund another twelve thousand because that money to get it was a hassle. So how would I come in and fund my money? And then I didn't want there was transaction with Bitcoin and everything. So I remember I, I saw someone posting uh, about Forex and I inboxed them and I asked them, how can I be able to use, uh, to use uh, which broker are you using? Because I have seen you're doing Forex. He was, uh, he was posting on, on Facebook. I don't know. I don't know. It was a stranger. He was a stranger. So I was like, 
what are you what are you using because i'm seeing you're a forex trader and this guy tells me i use xm and i'm like xm just two name x and m yeah i'm using xm so he told me just google like this guy was like just google about them uh and i said uh he he told me these people are good because the minimum amount you are supposed to deposit is five dollars and and guys listen and you can deposit using M-Pesa. Do you know, hey, like that was my light moment. Like I felt like I'm, I'm being, I have been bathed. Like I was, it sounded too good to be true because all the brokers that I would do research, they were either doing Bitcoins or Visa cards. By that time, I didn't even, the banks here in Kenya, I didn't have a Visa, I didn't have a Visa card. So either they were doing visa card bitcoins or these funny funny uh wallets so i had them person i was like what m -Pesa? you must be joking how m -Pesa? and i was so happy and it was like the minimum amount you should deposit is five dollars so i went on the xm uh website and i created my account and i deposited i had a thousand kenya shillings so it was like around seven dollars now, depositing with XM was so easy. I didn't need to buy Bitcoins and we were using M-Pesa. So once I deposited, I still didn't find it. Like I was like, how are these people so good? Like the deposit was so, so fast, the transaction. Remember the other broker, the Bitcoin could take time. So it was not immediately, even after you do the transaction for you to see your amount on the MT4, it used to take time. So this one is just fast, fast, fast. So I traded and I with, I think, I don't know, I can't remember uh, uh, the money I withdrew, the exact amount, but it came back to my MPSA and I was so happy. Guys, the reason why I am recommending XM, I'm recommending XM because for the past four years, since 2020, I have been using XM and this being the fifth year. So we have the whole of 2020, I've used XM. 2021, 2022, 2023, and 2024. This is the fifth year, and the fifth year is ending on July. But then I will do a, I will do like a party where my fifth year is ending on July. So that's why I did a video five years in forex. So I my my I will say July. I can say I have done five years in for like I've been in five years doing forex. So I am four years and some few months, and. I have never had a problem with XM. So many people have been requesting me, why do you trade with XM? Can I trade with XM? If you're listening to me and you don't have a broker, I did not do this video until now. And there was a reason because you don't want just to come and create a video and say, oh, I support XM because of, you just want people to, to, to get in using your link, no. Me, before I say I support someone or I support a company, I have to be very careful because I want to speak my truth. The reason why I am telling you that XM is the best because they still, the minimum amount that you can deposit is $5 and you can use M-Pesa and they have added so many things. So if you're not in Kenya, there's still so many things. There's the visa, there's the wallet, you can use Krill and I will show you all that. So for me, I think the reason why I have used XM for all those years is I have never had any problem with XM as a broker. If you have any problem, their customer care is good. And if you have been looking for a broker or you don't have a broker, this video is the right video for you to create account. So what I will do, I will show you the steps to create an account. I have given you my testimony. I hope you will have a good relationship with XM and I hope you will find that this is the best broker in 2024 and in, in other years to come. So every year we'll be making such a video just encouraging people who are looking for broker. You can imagine the hassles that I went when I was beginning. So if you have a broker that maybe you're not clear about them, either you deposit, the depositing it has an issue, you can come to exam and now i want to show you what to do so let me share my screen so i will share my screen right now so if you don't uh if you if you don't if you don't have um it's called a what 
If you don't have an account, this is what we are doing. Or maybe you are using a different broker. If you're using a different broker, you can still have multiple brokers. You can have XM as your broker and there's no problem. So what I want you to do, the video that you're watching, this video that you're watching, so it will be like this. It will be like a posted video like this. So I just want you at the below, you know, you have to tell people what to do. So at below on my video, the video, of course, will be best Forex broker. You'll just come here and there will be a link there. My Forex broker, I trust with 100% bonus join today. So I want you to click that link if you're watching me and you're watching this video. Just click that link like that and you will be brought in this page. This is the page that they will bring, uh, you will get to see this page. So of course it won't have these details. The reason why we have these details is because um, I was trying to create an account. So this, you will have a page like this and it's just saying, let's get you started. Already have an account login. So if you have an account, you can log in. Country of residence, if you are in all this country, XM is available for you. So I hope you won't, uh, you won't find difficult getting your country. So all these are countries that XM uh, is currently at. And you can see all these countries. So I hope you won't type and say, oh, my country is not available. So because I'm from Kenya, I'll just type Kenya. K for Kenya. So Kenya is my country. And then for email. So let's say you do not have an email. Let's say you, here you do not have an email and you really want to uh, create an account. What you can do, you can come in and create a new email. You can say Gmail. I'm, I'm showing, you know, many people, we can assume, you know, we assume these things or maybe you want to use a different email. You can create a different email uh, because you, you don't want maybe to mix the email. So Gmail, uh, we want to create a Gmail. Let's go here, create a Gmail account. So if I want to create a Gmail account, you can see what it is telling me, create a Gmail account, sign up. So I will click that create a Gmail account and the first name, you can see the first name. So you will pick the first name and let's say I am creating a, an account for, for my, let me, I will use my daughter. She's called Chiara because I don't want to use someone I don't know. So I will create that. That's her name, Chiara. And the last name is optional. So the, the, the last name they have said is optional. So let's go with first name and then we will be picking the month, the day, and the year. So I'm showing you how to create a Gmail account. She was born in October, date 22. And then here for the year, you can put the year that you will put. So I don't want to put the year because she'll look underage. I will just put 1993 so that they can allow me to create. And then female like that so next so that's how you will do it's so easy to create a gmail account so how how you will sign in so let's see if they will uh, allow chiara at gmail let's see if it is available they are saying it's not available so can we say chiara 20 21 Let's see if that is available. So they are saying it's not available. Of course, there are so many people who are called Chiara. And if at all, I can say, I can put Chiara Kamoche. Let's see if I will get that. So it has allowed because, of course, I have differentiated. So if you find your email is not getting created, it's just because there are so many people with the same. So I have done Shara Kamoche. Kamoche is the dad. So password, you can do easy password, like the one that is so easy for you not to, for you not to forget. So I will, I will do I will stop sharing so that I can create the password and then so you will see me 
you're seeing me, but I am creating, I'm just creating the password. Uh, where is, where we create password? So I'll just create the password without you seeing me. So creating, you cannot have a broker without, you cannot have a broker, guys, without having a Gmail. You see why, the reason why I am showing you how to create uh, to create the Gmail is because I don't want anyone to be stuck. People get stuck because you have gone and the broker is asking you for an email. So the only thing we can do is to ask for uh is to ask for for the Gmail app. It's to ask it is to do the 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 Gmail. Okay. So I am back. Let me share again. I have created the password. So once you click the, the password, it will bring to this page. You can add a recovery email or you skip. So here, the step of creating the Gmail has already succeeded. So I'll just skip. And this is how my email will look like. So I don't want to show you creating XM account with a fake email. That's why I created a real email because if you do with a fake email for confirmation, they will have to send it to this email. So you'll just say next and the, the account has been opened. So this is not XM opening. We are opening Gmail account because when you go to XM, they will have to ask you for a Gmail account. So I am just showing you how to go about it so that you don't have, you don't miss, okay? So you can see now we have everything and then we'll go to our Gmail. So the Gmail is chiarakamoche.com. And once you create the Gmail, you can go back to the step where you left. So you can see if the XM will bring us a, a message, it will come to that. So you can see now if I must to if I must to to if I must to give the the Gmail, I will come and copy paste this one. You see? So that's what I will copy paste and come and paste it where I'm being asked the email. Okay, guys. And then the password, I can I can write any password. And I, I think I will do the same password I have done. So what I can do, I'll just stop sharing so that I can do the password, guys. So the password, and I hope you're not seeing the password. <laughs> it's so simple. If you understand this, it will be good for you. So I hope I've gotten the password. So let's go back. I share again so that I can show you exactly what I'm doing. So here we have done the password and then you have to agree and then you'll click register. Imagine creating account is that easy. The reason why I went to so big hassle of getting, the reason why I wanted to even create a Gmail is because if I created a fake email, they will send that confirmation to this email. You can read here, please check your email. An email has been sent to Chiara Kamoche 2021. Please verify your email. So you'll have to verify your email. That's why I had to use I had to use a real email so that we can go to our inbox. And what you can see here from our inbox is the message from XM. So you will click that message from XM. XM is saying verify your email address. Okay. So we have this to when we have to verify. So if I click verify email address, I am now verified by XM. And it's that easy. So creating an account with Excel, many people keep asking me, Esther, how do we create? How do we create? So now you have an account and this account is MT5. This account is MT5. I will still show you how to create MT4, but I'll just explain because if you're not verified, you cannot go to the next step. So the only thing now here I can show you is that the number here, this is your ID number. You can see this is the ID number. 
this is the ID number. So we have the balance is zero, of course. So what they want you to do first, they want you to verify this account. So you'll come here and click verify now. Now, here, these are personal details that I cannot help you. So what you'll do, you will add your name, you add optional. Here, you are adding date of birth. Remember, the date of birth has to match with your ID where the, you know, your ID, your in, uh, it has the, the date of birth. So let it not have a confusion because remember, XM, they are looking for, this one is called Know Your Customer, yeah? So they want to know who am I dealing with? So you have to give real details. Don't come here and start just guesswork because they will know once you give your date of birth, the minute you're going to, to do the proof of identity, you will have to submit your ID. So don't just mention, don't just do things because you just want to do them. So when you are here, let's add your profile. You'll do your first name, you'll do your middle name, you'll do your last name, and then you do your date of birth and your phone number. Once we are there, you will click continue. If you can see the steps here, first of, first of all is personal. Personal information, that one is easier, you will do it. Then you can do investor profile. Investor profile is when they will ask you few questions and those are questions that you can be able to answer. They may be asked, they can ask you how much are you willing to deposit between this and this amount, or they can ask you a question just to see the knowledge of your trading how is your knowledge if trading is concerned? And then step three is the document. So for many people, they don't know how this goes. If you are supposed to submit document for proof of identity, what you do for the, for the document, you post your ID, the proof of identity. When they go to ask your utility bill, you post at the back of your ID. So the proof of uh, identity and proof of residence is the you just post the id so proof of ID identity you post you screenshot either you take a photo this one i can't show you guys it's hard to show you because i will need to open for someone live so that you can see and maybe what i can do next month when i have classes physical classes the when i'm doing it with a physical student we will do it so that majority of people can know what happens even the verification so that's what i will do with a physical student someone who is real so for the document, if they ask you open real account, uh, uh, prove identity, you just take a, a, a camera, open the camera, take the front of your ID, and then go to the next step. If they ask proof of resident, turn your ID and post the back of your ID. And once you come back, you will be verified, okay? So that is to tell you that you cannot deposit. If I come here and I try to deposit, I cannot deposit because it will still take me back to the same level. So majority of people have been asking me, why am I not able to, de to deposit? You cannot be able to deposit because of not having. And then we cannot able to add additional account because you're not yet verified. But... Bottom line is that you have had, this is exactly what you will do. And you can see here, we are being told not to verify, verify your account to start trading. So there are so many things you cannot do if you're not verified. So if I continue, let me go to, this is the, the XM and this is how the page looks like. You can see the, the XM, um, this is how the XM looks like. And we have all those, they have won so many prizes, meaning they are very good. They are very good with what they do. They have won so many awards and they are also, they also offer all these platforms. So if you go to XM, you will see what I even love about these companies because their website is so easy to maneuver. You can either go to home trading platforms, platforms you can see, you can put it on PC, Mac, uh, web trader mt5 for pc all these are platforms it is compatible with iphone android and all those so platforms and xm offers education so if you still want tutorials to know how to trade it's a good place you can go and learn from them okay and they have so many promotionals just just opportunities to promote people like this one win your share of $140,000. So these are competitions that you can enter and they happen. They are real demos and 
uh, they are for real accounts and the demo so and then there's copy trading copy trading uh, is another thing that i'll be discussing with time uh the offers that are there at xm so we have the news they can the the like uh, discussing news so if you are a fundamental trader this is the website to always come and log in i i said about about awards you can see these are many awards uh outstanding global forex broker i'm i'm talking of the best broker here so they have won so many awards and you can see them so this is a broker that we can all choose to start our journey of forex with okay so what you can do now guys is to just click the link in the description box below and this is what will happen anyone who is under me and i can either create a group to even help you more because if at all you have joined with my link there's there's more i can do to you by helping you to know so if you happen to create an account using my link you can ask me questions i can help even to set it up uh, to your phone so if you do that don't come to ask me about other brokers i don't do other brokers i only do xm so if you come to ask me about xm and you have used my link if you don't use the link uh, it's fine but don't come and ask me what do i do what do i do so i will be able even to help more people as long as you use my link there are some things i can do for you guys once you join with the link okay and i think that is the end um there i have said xm you deposit so fast using uh, other wallets like skrill they allow visa they allow so many payments method the minimum balance amount to put is five dollars they have uh they give credit so there are times that they will have a 50 percent bonus credit 20 percent bonus credit 100 percent bonus credit it varies with the with what the season is so i hope that you have understood uh this video and you know you will make a choice anyway guys it was so good and so glad to share my my review of xm and once you create account you can whatsapp me and i will once you whatsapp me we can go ahead and maybe help you further but you have to have used my link if you use my link i will help you all the best and see you in the next one bye bye love you